Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me. So in today's video, it's going to be a little bit different. I'm going to be showing you guys how I package my latest orders. All right, so you already know I got a sanitize. Our first order is for Caroline. And these are the categories that she chose for her foiled cash envelope. So she picked up, I believe it was three sets of our fold cash envelopes. Did I say that right? Mm -hmm. Anyway, so these are her cat categories and she wanted one of them to be blank <laughs> so yeah so i'm just gonna go ahead and prep her order every cash envelope gets cleaned up thoroughly before it gets shipped out because you know you gotta keep everything clean honey so yeah i'm just going to go ahead and thoroughly clean each one and make sure it's shiny and yeah ready for arrival basically so once i'm all done cleaning them up I go ahead and basically organize them all right so then i go ahead and i put in the envelopes into a self-sealing poly bag this kind of helps keep everything together and honestly just gives a more professional look and i love the sound it makes when i take off the sealing part of it so just appreciate the asmr in it <laughs> Ooh, i love the sound so yeah i go ahead and fold it up all right and then what i usually do is i go ahead and flap down is that what it's, I'm supposed to say? Close down the flaps? I pull down the flaps? Yeah. So then it kind of like gets snug when I go ahead and pack it up. I go ahead and put a thank you sticker just to help hold the flaps in order as well. And as you can see, like my gloss got stuck in underneath the stickers. I couldn't find my tweezers. But y'all, you gotta do it with what you have in it. So then I'm going to go ahead and write a personalized note for her. I always like to put the customer's name along with a heart. So here we go, Caroline. Thank you so much for ordering from my small business. I really do appreciate you. So yeah, every um, order comes with a personalized, personalized note. <laughs> the struggle is real, sis. The struggle is real. And yeah, I really enjoy writing these notes. I feel like it's very thoughtful. And I think customers really appreciate the small things in life, you know? So yeah. So then I go ahead and I put the order into this packing tissue paper um honestly i kind of just feel like it's cute and stuff and i really wanted my customers to kind of have like a a whole experience like they're opening a gift so i went ahead and i added that into my whole packaging process and you're gonna see like right now at this moment like my color scheme was black and gold um but i went ahead and i switched it up so you're going to see like throughout some videos that i'm going to be uploading that what I use is going to be different. Anyways, I put a thank you sticker on top of it. Yeah, because I really want my customers to see that as soon as they open the package to know how thankful I am for their support. And then I just go ahead and slide in the whole packaging into the bubble mailer along with some free stickers. Who doesn't love stickers? So yeah, I go ahead and put the stickers along with the thank you card inside the bubble mailer and seal it up. Enjoy the ASMR. Oof, I'm telling you y'all, I'm sorry if you're not like an ASMR fan, but I am. So yeah, when, once I'm done, I go ahead and put on the label, the shipping label, and it, it's good to go. Thank you so much, Caroline, for your order, hon. All right, so our next order is going to be for Sav. Oh, hi, Sav. Hey, girl. So she ordered one set of our rose gold foil cash envelopes, and she wanted gas, groceries, and personal. You already know, clean it up real good so it's ready for it. It to be used so Sav and I connected on TikTok and she's actually from my hometown so it definitely made me super happy to connect with someone that's from where I grew up to be honest so yeah I'm going to go ahead and you already know put the whole thing into the self-sealing bag let me know if you guys are interested in like a whole series of I guess my day as an entrepreneur or like running my small business i really want to be able to give you guys insights like i feel like us canadians we don't really have a lot of options out there so yeah if you're interested in like wanting to know where i got my stuff and basically you know the behind the scenes of owning a small business let me know you already know um thank you card and i wrote a portion of hers in french because she speaks french Donc, merci, mon amour. so go ahead and put this whole thing together and I always like to say happy budgeting because, <laughs> I mean, that's the whole point, right? And I also got to end it with a little small autograph of mine. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. You already know it's cold here, okay, in Canada. So, you got to make sure these envelopes are snug and kept warm. <laughs> 
So yeah, after I'm done all of that, I really love the process of simply like putting the whole thing into the tissue wrapping paper. And yeah, listen, I could not find some type of music to put in the background. Honestly, I thought like filming packaging videos were going to be easy, but it's not. It's actually very tedious, but I love it. You already know. Thank you, sticker. But yeah, like I'm trying to, you know, kind of provide different content for you guys. Let me know if you like these type of videos. Free stickers. Go boss. You already know. Putting it inside her bubble mailer for her. I love bubble mailers. Um, and then put in the whole shebang, her stickers as well as her thank you note. And it's basically ready to be shipped out. Everything is good to go. hi <laughs> but yeah so then you already know putting the shipping label and boom on to the next one thank you so much Sav. merci next we have tarsa oh girl let me tell you something y'all tarsa and i are connected on tiktok as well and i'm not even gonna lie first of all let me talk about her order she ordered five sets of our foiled envelopes um so amongst those five sets four of them she did not want labeled because she was going to use them as um, envelopes for her saving challenges so yeah other ones the last set is for her personal use so she chose house me time as well as personal but like i was saying um Tahsan, i reconnected on tiktok actually i feel like i meet a lot of you guys through tiktok so shout out to tiktok and um we instantly connected once we both found out that we were from montreal so from the same city and she speaks french as well so you already know what go on. It was an instant hit. So she and I are actually friends. We literally talk on the phone. We message each other. She's such an amazing person. So yeah, thank you so much, Tarsa. So I'm going to go ahead and finalize her order. You already know, personalized note or whatever. But yeah, y'all, let me know in the comments below what's your favorite part when it comes to uh, packaging orders. I personally love when I put everything into the bubble mailer. Like, I don't know. It's just so satisfying. So you already know. I'm going to go ahead and finish this up. So at first, yeah, like I thought I was going to be able to fit this whole order um, in my regular bubble mailer size. But she kind of thick, thick. So I went ahead and switched it up. You're going to see it like in the end of the video or throughout the video. That I went ahead and I switched up into a bigger bubble mailer. That way everything would like just be more cozy and it wouldn't be tight. So yeah, good thing I had other bubble mailers on deck. That's one thing I like, you know, having options. The struggle is real, y'all. The struggle is real. I need to find those tweezers. <laughs> so it's all said and done. Well, as you can see, I kind of struggled at the beginning because I thought it was going to fit. But she did order multiple sets. So I went ahead and I switched it out. Took this medium bubble mailer. So it's always good to have a... Um, a few options when it comes to packaging everything's going in smoothly so yeah i put the stick uh, stickers no not snickers the stickers in seal it up and then it's good to go so after that i simply went ahead and dropped off the whole thing to the post office i hope you guys enjoyed this video y'all thank you so much for the love and support if you enjoyed these kind of videos y'all make sure to let me know in the comments i can drop more of them for you love y'all bye